The actor, who was not present for the verdict, was pictured at the Bridge Tavern in Newcastle on Wednesday evening. It comes as Mr. Depp has been in Britain performing on stage for three nights in a row with musician Jeff Beck. The actor sued his ex-wife for $50 million over her 2018 article in the Washington Post titled, I spoke up against sexual violence, and faced our culture's wrath. That has to change. The piece does not mention Mr. Depp by name but his lawyers said it falsely implied he physically and sexually abused Ms. Heard while they were together. Following six weeks of evidence and around 13 hours of deliberation, jurors returned a verdict in favor of Mr. Depp on Wednesday. The actor was awarded compensatory damages of $10 million, £8 million, and a further $5 million, £4 million, in punitive damages. Following the verdict, Mr. Depp said in a statement he was humbled that the jury had given me my life back. He said, from the very beginning, the goal of bringing this case was to reveal the truth, regardless of the outcome. Speaking the truth was something that I owed to my children and to all those who have remained steadfast in their support of me. I feel at peace knowing I have finally accomplished that. I am, and have been, overwhelmed by the outpouring of love and the colossal support and kindness from around the world. I hope that my quest to have the truth be told will have helped others, men or women, who have found themselves in my situation, and that those supporting them never give up. I also hope that the position will now return to innocent until proven guilty, both within the courts and in the media.